How was it going to be C Nation? Welcome back to a brand new video. This video is going to be called My Thoughts on on the Life in a Day movie. So if you didn't hear about the Life in a Day, it's a YouTube original movie. Uh, YouTube premiere, whatever they call it. Uh, YouTube premium movie, whatever. It's a YouTube premium movie. It's called Life in a Day. Which, this is a sequel to the first one they did. It's basically where, it's a documentary where it docks people's lives in one day. Last year, uh, not last year, 10 years ago, it was July 24th, and today it's July 25th. I think that's interesting, seeing someone's life, just one day of someone's life on a, on a movie that's going to pre premiere at a film festival and then going to be on YouTube next year. That's going to be something cool. That's going to be really cool to see. And I think I personally will send something in, see if it gets in the movie. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I don't care. It's not the end of the world. But I think that's interesting because you don't see a lot of documentaries doing that. You see, most documentaries that you see are history-based or science-based documentaries or on one subject. If it's multiple subjects, you're going to see documentary about anything. You can find documentary about anything. There's... Documentaries have been done about any subject in history, science, the world. For example, I was watching a documentary a couple of days ago about the Qin Dynasty and then the Japanese Empire. Those two documentaries. That's just an example. It's like, I like this concept because it's, it's a documentary made by people. It's not just something that they go out and record or historians, which I love history documentaries. I love science documentaries. I love that kind of stuff. I love documentaries in general, but I love seeing this. I love seeing documentaries where people can participate and record themselves, and it's just one big documentary. It's, we want to know what you're up to this day. It's like, it's not something random, you know, which I enjoy. I really do enjoy it. I enjoy documentaries like that. I think that's a good concept. So I think people should go participate. I'm not... Paid to say any of this stuff. If I was, I would be saying I wouldn't make my own opinions on it. I would be reading off a script, which I'm not. I just think it's a good concept. People should go participate because it's something that you don't see all the time. You don't see documentaries of just people, of their day, of what they're up to on one day. You don't see or just documentaries about people. You see documentaries about topics about other topics you know about random things about history or something in history or science in the world that happened in the world that's what kind of documentaries you see which I love like I said but I think this is a good concept because it gets people out there to do something to do stuff that they want to do to show the world this is how I live this is my day it doesn't matter what day it is. This is my day-to-day -day stuff. It's just you're seeing one day of my life. And it's and it's going to be on YouTube. It's going to be a movie. Like 20, 30, 40, 50 minutes long of people's lives. And yeah, they do have what you can record and stuff like that. That's understandable. What, How to get into it. It has to be 24 frames, 24 frames per second. Which is understandable. Because you can't have like a 1992 camera and record something for 2020. You can't. It's not going to work. It will work, but it's not going to work to get... It will work to record, but it won't work to get into the movie. Which, since it is a YouTube, hopefully it's not just a marketing stunt where, oh yeah, participate and no one that actually participated gets into the movie. Hopefully the people that participate get into the movie... I think they're teaming up with YouTube because it's easy because YouTube's so big now. Back in what 2010, YouTube YouTube was popular was it's not as popular as it was like in 2011 maybe. It was popular in 2010. It is it, it was getting popularity in like 2008 and then it spiked up around 2010, 2000 around 2012 maybe because it's when like Mark and all those people, you know, I don't want to talk about all those YouTubers that made YouTube popular. I'm going to talk about this movie. So, I'm going to send something in, see what happens, see if I get into it. If I don't, it's not the end of the world. I think it's just an interesting concept because 
it's one day in the world, all around the world. People, you see people all around the world. You you see people document their day, and they get into this documentary. It's made by people about people. It's a documentary made by people about people, which is. Which is fantastic for people because we get to see people's lives on today on July 25th. We get to see how it's changed, how the world's changed, how the world looks different, different places of the world. All that in one documentary for one day comes out next year. It's going to premiere next year. It's going to go at the film fest and then premiere next year. Which I'm actually excited to see. I'm going to watch it anyways. If if it's free, hopefully it's free. But it is a YouTube premiere, so I don't reach original, so I don't think it's going to be free, you know, on YouTube. But if it is, it's going to be great. I'm going to, I'll probably just get a YouTube premiere membership or whatever it's called. And premium, YouTube premium, get one and, and watch the movie. Because I think it's interesting. I think people should go watch it. I think it's going to be interesting to see. I didn't see the first one. I should go see if I can find the first one somewhere in the world. It has to be somewhere. See, it has to be on DVD somewhere. You can probably find it on DVD. But that's 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 basically my opinion on it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I just rambled about other stuff, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, press the share button, press the like button, press the red shine, subscribe button, press the bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. I'll see you guys next video. Hopefully this doesn't freeze. This is my second time recording it because I recorded it yesterday. If you guys didn't see the upload, that's why I say press the bell. Stay notified every time I upload. I up, stay notified every time I upload a video because this it fro it uploaded perfectly. The video froze. It played the video, but it was just one picture. So I don't know what why I did that. But hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.